Hey guys, hello. Okay, we have here a Lincoln Memorial Sense. Let's talk about the 1979D Lincoln Memorial Sense. Okay, I have some information here about the 1979D and the 1979 No Mint Mark. I have I have information, but I don't have. A 1979 no mint mark. It's only the 1979D that I have, okay? Okay, let's read the information. Okay, first let's read what is written on the coin. It's very important, okay? In God we trust. Liberty, 1979D. Okay? At the back of the coin, United States of America, E Pluribus Unum, FG, the designer's initial, one cent, and the Lincoln Memorial. Okay, now, let's find out the value or the price of a 1979D Lincoln Memorial cents and the 1979 no mint mark, okay? Let's read the information. Okay. Nineteen seventy nine D, okay. First, let's read the nineteen seventy nine D. Okay, here we go. The nineteen seventy nine D penny was made at the Denver Mint. It bears a small D, mint mark below the date on the obverse head side of the coin. The U.S. Mint, the U.S. Mint struck 4,139,357,254 examples of the 1979 D penny. And like its Philly Mint counterpart, it's becoming harder to find in circulation these days despite its big mintage number. Also, the Philadelphia born penny, the 1979 D. Lincoln cent, is worth more than its face value due to the coin's copper composition. The typical worn circulated 1979 D. Penny has a value of Two to three cents. Okay. Average uncirculated specimens trade for 10 to 30 cents. The most valuable 1979 D penny sold for $3,995 in 2016. Okay. Okay, let's read again. The 1979D penny was made at the Denver Mint. It bears a small D mint mark below the date on the obverse of the coin. The U.S. Mint struck 4,139,357,254 examples of the 1979D penny. And like its Philly Mint counterpart, it's becoming harder to find in circulation these days. Despite its big mintage number. Also, like the Philadelphia born penny, the 1979 D. Lincoln cent is worth more than its face value due to the coin's copper composition. The typical worn 1979 D. penny has a value of 2 to 3 cents. Average uncirculated specimens trade for 10 to 30 cents. The most valuable 1979 D penny sold for $3,995 in 2016. Okay, that's the 1979. Let's move to 1979 No Mint Mark. Okay, let's read the information about the 1979 No Mint Mark. Okay, here we go. In fact, that's why the mint switch 
metals in the early 1980s because the value of the copper inside the coin was poised to be worth more than the coin's stated value of one cent. So pretty much any 1979 penny you find is worth two to three cents for its copper value alone. But some are worth much more still. For example, uncirculated 1979 penny, pennies without a mint mark, such as those that are fresh from the bank rolls and have never been spent as money, usually worth 10 to 30 cents apiece. The most valuable no mint mark 1979 penny sold for $5,463 in a 2012 auction. Wow, $5,463 for 1979 no mint mark. Okay, let's read again. In fact, that's why the mint switch metal in the early 1980s because the value of the copper inside the coin was poised to be worth more than the coin's stated value of one cent. So pretty much any 1979 penny you find is worth two to three cents for its copper value alone. But some are worth much more still. For example, uncirculated 1979 pennies without a mint bar, such as those that are fresh from the bank rolls and have never been spent as money, are usually worth 10 to 30 cents apiece. The most valuable no mint mark 1979 penny sold for 5463 in a 2012 auction. Okay, that's all. I hope I was able to provide some information for coin collecting. Okay, bye for now. Don't forget to subscribe. And... Have a great day. Let's check the let's check the the value. Okay. The most valuable no mint mark. 1979 penny sold for 5463 in a 2012 auction. Okay, check the other one. Okay. The 1979, the average uncirculated specimen trade for 10 to 30 cents. The most valuable 1979 D penny sold for $3,995. in 2016. Okay, have a great day.